In this video of Link Building Masterclass Part 2, we will use already ranking URLs related to your keyword to add backlinks to your website. Yes. So hey guys, my name is Raman and welcome to Webby Digital Channel. And in this video, we will use already ranking URLs on Google from top 10 to top 20 and contact them to add link to your website with this particular strategy. So how to do it and how I have done it. So I will describe that with the help of a free tool or a free way to do it or a paid way to do it. If you haven't subscribed to this channel, please click that red button to boost our morale to more and more strategies like this. So let's get started. So first thing you need to do is you need to shortlist or you need to do some research work before applying this particular method. So first you need to do is go to Chrome, just start with this style sheet going to the sheets.new and it will create a new spreadsheet for you to add or to add all your research elements to it so here it is uh, let me rename that to research for backlinks so now first thing you need to do is you need to shortlist the urls you want to rank for example let me go to my blog here so here what i'm going to do is i'm going to build link for this particular blog okay just for the demonstration let me copy that and let me provide a handle so this will be my link for which i want to build links on so now i have to finalize the anchor text to it and for the anchor text what you need to do is you need to add the keywords you want to rank for it so in this case i want to rank for how to use css image sprites okay so anchor text will be this let me paste that here okay so anchor text will be this. You can add three or more anchor text. Obviously, you don't want them to be branded or something like that. You have to be broad so that it will look natural to Google. Obviously, you don't want your website or URL to get penalized, right? And there, add two or three more anchor text to it. Like here, I'm adding it. So this is it, right? So now, what we are going to do is in the free way, we are going to find or research for the links that are already linking related to this particular anchor text now what you need to do is you need to shortlist your broad niche okay what is the broad niche here is the anchor text as we know it is how to use css image sprites right and now we know there are two main things here first is image sprites and there is css so what you can do is you can find keywords related to any of them either css image sprites i don't think you need to add a full of it like you need, don't need to search for the whole topic of your content suppose if you want to search for the css image sprites here right and every url out there is about css image sprites and how to build css image sprites right and obviously they won't link back to this particular url because it will harm their seo weightage to that particular url because the topic for both urls or both topic will or both content will be the same suppose if i am ranking for the seo keyword i don't want to add external link or a do follow link for the competitor that for the same particular keyword i don't want to harm myself to gain another right and for this part you have to see or search for the broad urls out there and for that part in the free method you can just search for the css tutorials or something like that right and here is actually different urls out there that can actually may backlink to your website but this particular method won't work for 100 percent of time because it is the short-term keyword obviously it's not a long-term keyword and for the short-term keyword the difficulty is very high and the urls that are already ranking on the search pages is have the highest weightage like obviously youtube not going to add the link in this particular video because it may be belong to the youtube or maybe belong to the content creator out there obviously tutorial points these are the heavy way weightage websites so that won't actually work for you so what i'm going to do is i'm going to broaden my search for this particular keyword and for that part you can use any keyword tool out there for this particular video i'm going to use get samrush so what you need to do is go to get samrush and sign up for the free account or even a one dollar account which gives you seven day trial and there you will be able to test this software out and it is actually the mind-blowing now click on this try it free 
so it will be redirected to your account just sign up with the google account as you can see it has landed there in my dashboard for what you need to do is seo sidebar here and go to keyword magic tool right there and now start searching for the long term keywords here is css tutorials just search for it and here is different keywords that has already ranking it so what i we are going to do is we are going to search for top 10 pages that are ranking for the long term keyword related to css tutorials so as you can see the keyword difficulty is very high obviously all those urls that are already ranking there will have a high weightage so you don't have to run for this so what i'm going to do is i'm going to filter that out keyword difficulty percentage to the lower to the maximum such that it will be available for so here you can see css pdf tutorial download so this is something you can actually take into account right and there is other tutorials available right here this is tailwind css tutorial there is something like that and here we have already said this keyword difficulty percentage to this and obviously you don't have to rely on this particular thing as you can see the volume is pretty low 30 20 40 so you can actually get the backlinks from them so shortlist any keywords from here okay just add start adding it to your keyword list just like that okay so after you start editing this just click on this open overview and after you click on the open overview you can see all those SERP analysis from the top five top one to top five and you can see the page authority scores of all of this and the domains and the keywords that as auxiliary already ranking there okay so what i want to do is i want you to check that has a lower page authority score and for the lower page authority score it will be easier to get more links to your website as you can see there's a zero obviously there's obviously if something is ranking for that particular keyword there must be something you can actually get the benefit from and there is page authority score two zero zero and up to ten you can easily contact them or open those urls and start adding to your worksheet so let me open all those urls here just for the demonstration i'm just adding three to it and what was my keyword my keyword was this one so now you should start adding the keyword for this and contact okay so first start adding all those links to them there there you go there you go and there so one by one you should start contacting them just open this particular url which is already ranking for that and see if it is something which benefit your website or your url obviously it is something about the css which you have told you also something about the tutorials so what we can do is we can actually contact them and ask them to add your link which is this particular content to their particular content such that it will benefit both sides because it is related to that particular content and you can add that as a more valuable external link to their website so what i am going to do is here i will have to see the contact information and there is a contact information you have to browse that either it is available on the header or the photo just go to the contact us and start contacting them like you authors do so for example let me tell you which i occasionally do here i have uh, contacted some website here okay and i have tell them i have hope this email find you well we love what you have built here and i want to inquire if you do allow guest post or link insertion or something and here i have provided my url and i want them to add link insertion to one of their blog posts so there is their reply they charge something for it obviously this is one of the biggest sites out there so they obviously charge for it because they have in thousands of visitors every day so what it is also the authority score is above 70 so they charge for it they charge around 760 something dollars and what it does is it will add so i don't mind paying them this amount to add links to the website so i don't mind that and what you need to go to contact and start creating your link building campaign and after you shortlist everything about it i suggest you to have around 20 to 30 urls into your worksheet with different keywords out there and start adding it and after you contact them just type out here contacted or something and add something to here 
like you can add conditional formatting to it like you have already done or not so this will be your template for your future link building strategy and there you need to add one more column of response and in the response section you have to edit it like if they want a free or trade like you can actually trade them to add their backlinks to one of your post or you can ask them for some fee or something or you can ask them for free if they actually write like your content or you can trade them with some content you are planning for your website to their website the strategy is to get more and more backlinks to your website so you should start adding those strategies into your link building camp and first will be to trade something and for for the trade part you have a trade to your website you can add link of them to one of the your post second will be to trade a content which you have already scraped or which you are planning for your website and let them have a content and let them have that particular content and trade that for a backlink so that's what you can do is, is second third is obviously fee so there must be a charge for something so there will be so you have to add the response here and next column will be acquisition so if you have acquired or not or acquired successfully or something you can start adding it so add as much as you are also like if your content is something that you want to rank on google so you should start adding such strategies in your daily link building campaign so i hope you have understand how to build links for your content using keywords related to that particular content that are already ranking on google so if you have learned something from this video click the like button because it i am revealing all my secrets to build links for a website free way paid way everything which we are going to cover in this particular playlist which actually works in real life so if you have learned something from this video click the like button and if you want to subscribe to this channel to learn more about link building digital marketing as a whole then you have a subscribe button and if you have some questions in mind you have a comment box with you but if you want to share this with to your friend colleague or social media handles you have a share button so see you in the next video until then bye bye